Hello everyone, welcome to Unified Study. So in this video, I am going to tell you very important information that is very important for you so that you can get your grace marks and you can confirm your UGC NET or JRA for assistant professor because if you are very close to the cutoff and if you are missing these marks, then maybe definitely again you have to learn six months more. So that's why it is better to go for this challenge of this question. So just see that and what the supportive document you can do, what you have to written, what you have to write for challenging this question. I am going to tell you the total process. Please watch this video till the end and definitely subscribe to the channel. Click the bell icon to get all the latest update and notification. And please like this video because definitely it is for you and you can like this video. So see. Here this was the tooth cavity question. This is the most problematic question of this time. So in this tooth cavity question, it was 2386 number question. And as per this question, they written that the next five questions are based on this passage. Okay, next five question is based on this passage. But what you can see in your PDF, in your response sheet, and that happened in our exam hall actually we did not get the question it was not in sequence how you can prove that if i am going to the response sheet that is 2386 this is the response sheet 2386 so definitely student can expect that the next question should be of this cavity question but the next question is the tree that is the game tree and after that also the next question is from the relational database. Actually the 237 this question is other than any other area and here is no table. After that 2388 8 question also there is no table. Actually they did not provide table and it is not in sequence. So that's why definitely the remaining four question what are not in sequence and they are the actual data is missing you did not get any table to do this question right so you can go for challenge that is 2387 2388 2389 and 2390 this four question definitely go for challenge and write down that there was data insufficient and check my answer sheet check my response sheet i am attaching this response sheet here here the question was not in sequence and the data is also missing where I can get the table so that I can solve it in the exam hall. It is the fault of NTA. They, they shuffle all the question actually. If it is a comprehension type question then it should be in sequence but it is not in sequence. It is the fault of UGC net but we cannot do. We have to go for challenge and we have to pay the money also. And after that remaining more two question is there that is also you can go for challenge that I am going to tell you please watch this till the end. And definitely money is a factor because for each and every question you have to pay the money of 1000. Really it is very difficult for any student. So already there is four question that is 4000. After that also there is two to three question that can be also challenge. So for that what is my suggestion I am telling you the remaining question also but my suggestion is that try to make a group of your friend means that from where you are learning definitely the friends groups are there try to make a friends groups try to collect the money from all of your friend means for those who are going to those who attempt the exam and those who wants to do the challenge. Because it is not a wise decision, everyone will go for the challenge of a same question. Because if anyone is doing the challenge and if they agree with that, then everyone will get the marks. That is the rule. So that's why my suggestion is there. Try to make a group of 7 to 8 friends and try to share the money to everyone. Means try to make a fund of 7000 or 5000, whatever question you are going to do. It can be more if you are trying, if you are able to do 10 friends, 15 friends, 20 friends together, try to collect the money and try to go for the challenge in that way. One friend will challenge one question, another friend will challenge another question, but 
you can share the money you can share the fund to each other so suppose that if it is 7000 is required then there are lots of friend if you are sharing 100 rupees also then also it is possible so that's why unity is required for doing going for the challenge you can be united you try to be united try to make a fund to do the challenge and from one many maybe you can log into your system and you can go for the challenge with your id also or you can challenge with other means all the friends will challenge with one one question that is also you can do so that is a suggestion from my end because i know that ki 4000 5000 amount is not a easy task for anyone now i am going to tell you this question is not a drop question okay some students are asking me that this question is going to be drop or not no this question is absolutely correct that is i have already discussed yesterday this is absolutely correct that there is no problem in this question but this question yeah, definitely this question have to be challenged here they provide the answer that only option b is correct but option a and option b both are correct so definitely the correct answer is 242925 that is a and b both are correct so you can go for the challenge because it is definitely a planar graph the supportive document you can draw the graph in that way that is a planar here this graph can be drawn in this way that is possible in this way you can draw this graph this is a planar graph so it is the isomorphic graph of this graph only so a is planar and b is also the planar that they already provide b is the correct so here a and b both are correct correct answer will be this you can go for challenge so two marks is here so already there is four and two that is 10 marks is definitely confirmed for the challenge after that also this question that is the toc question you can go for the challenge because all the answer is okay but here the problem is that we face that problem student face that problem that it was uh, in zoom in mode because the total question was not showing but we don't know ki they will accept that or not but you can go for it because it was not a authentic and it was not a proper image was not showing in the exam hall that you can tell them and that you can go for it but we don't know they will drop it or not but we can go for it also so this is another toc question and another question is there that is uh, some students are telling about that paper 1 di di and rc that is reading comprehension and di this was a mixing mixing one question so that question also you can support that ki yes here is the data of the rc and how i will solve the di that is also you can tell so that question also you can go for challenge so as there was lots of issues there is at least 10 to 12 to 14 marks can be also grace marks so that is possible try to go for it try to do the challenge but definitely this five question that is the Um, uh, propo uh, that is the probability question, tooth cavity four question, and this graph theory that is five question. This ten marks to have to be confirmed. So try to go for challenge. Try to do it. Try to be united each other, and try to make a fund and go for challenge. And after that, if you need any help from myself, then try to comment in the comment section. Let me know what help you need. Uh, so that i can suggest you what you can do so hope for the best definitely you will crack your exam really it is not expect uh, accepted from nta why they are doing this way really we cannot accept that but let's see hope for the best see you soon in my next video bye bye